You guys obviously were due for a road win. You finally get it after seven straight losses on the road. What was most impactful from your view to getting this win on the road? Uh, I just think it was uh, we, we got to play two uh, complete halves for the most part. I think uh, obviously we had some slippage um, a little bit in the first half, but I think overall those were this is probably our uh, overall um, in terms of two halves put together uh, our best game so far. They messed around in the second half. Came out, had a nice third quarter, and then responded right back with a dominant four. Yeah, um, that's how it's got to be. I think uh, we, we do a great job of uh, putting ourselves in a good position to start the second half. So we just got to be mindful on the road that we have to have a, uh, we have to come with more energy and, and, and more, um, you know, what I mean, more intention than than the, oppos than the opposition coming in the second half. That's just been kind of our kryptonite so far. Just coming into the second half, just having a slow start. So I think tonight we just uh, make sure that we have better start tonight. How impactful was the zone in disrupting what Atlanta usually wants to do and can do offensively? They got a lot of they got a lot of guys uh, that, that they can ISO and make uh, great decisions off pick and roll, make shots, and make uh, life hard on us um, if we're going in man. So I think the zone just kind of, kind of throws off the options that they're really looking for, the primary options, and it kind of forces their, their, their it kind of forces their guys to uh, that want to shoot the ball to, to to pass it. So that's not their that's not their primary. Um, you know, I mean, it's not that primary option that they want to do. So just put them in that position is good for us. To Bam's point about your scoring, by the way, uh, last three games have been phenomenal. Uh, flow of things, you're being a little more aggressive. What's what's bet most at play? Yeah, I think it's a little bit of both. I think it's just obviously just how the, how the game is flowing, how the, you know, where I'm getting my, where I'm getting the ball, where I'm getting spots, and just being aggressive and just making things happen and just being confident. Uh, you know, just letting the ball go when I'm when I have an op open opportunity and I'm seeing lanes, I'm I'm finding angles to get to the rim, and uh, I just kind of have playmaking on my mind primarily. So I just think that it keeps guys honest and it, it, it's just kind of contagious, uh, contagious basketball. Getting guys involved, they want to get you back involved. So it's um, we you know we're just sharing. Insane. You guys had not won a road game since October 26th. I mean, did, did you guys feel that? And how good is it to get off that tonight, especially the start of a tough four-game trip? Uh, Coach let us know that he put that on the board one and seven. So, uh, which I didn't even obviously realize. I know that we were struggling on the road, but to, just to put it in perspective for us and just see it on the board is, like he was saying, is is pretty disgusting uh, to us to to see that we're how good of a team we are and that we're one and seven on the road. And not only that. That we've been losing on the road, just, just how we've been losing on the road. Every, all the, they've all been winnable games, so uh, we know we we're going to put ourselves in a, in a position to win the game. So I think that we just made sure with, with better, we came in with better intentions and just try to play a, a, a complete, a full game today with two halves. You see a guy like uh, Tyler who made his name on scoring, made his name on shooting, but seems to get it now that there's other things that I think he was like 0 for 8 on threes, maybe 3 for 12, someone left in the field, and yet he made a very positive contribution. Is that the next step you see in growth from players when they're sort of the hot shots to the complete player? For sure. Uh, it's just, you know, not everybody's got that. Like you said, like you said, like not everybody's got that willingness to learn and, and um, expand their game because – the next part of people's game, you know, with guys who like that can put the ball in, in the hole is is sharing. And so whenever you're so caught up and want to score the ball, a lot of guys don't want to necessarily want to do that next step. And the fact that he's willing to do that just shows you that one, he's in for the team, and two, that it's just, like you saying, it just the the proof is in the pudding. It's on the court. He's got a triple double, so it's just showing you that he can uh, contribute in more ways than one. Appreciate it. Thank Appreciate you.